Hey everybody, time for a quick Bible trek. We're looking at Luke chapter 2. You know it's the Christmas story. Uh, I want to think about life. It's hard, right? Life is described as a veil of tears. Uh, perpetual living in the valley of the shadow of death. And especially as people get towards the end of their life and get the fear of death. Uh, it's scary, isn't it? You're going to die and face this unknown. Is it the end or is it just the beginning? Well, there's this guy named uh, Yaroslav Pelikan who is a famous uh, historian, well accomplished, basically a genius. And he said on his deathbed, you know, if Jesus is risen, nothing else matters. And if Jesus isn't risen, nothing else matters. And he's kind of is pointing out the same thing we see in Luke chapter 2. Here, there's this old man who is about to die and he's just hanging on and he's in a temple and his name is Simeon and he sees the baby Jesus and he takes him in his arm and he says this he he prays and thanks God and says Lord now now you are letting your servant depart in peace according to your word for my eyes have seen your salvation that you've prepared in the presence of all peoples a light for revelation to the Gentiles and for glory to your people Israel He knew he was ready to die because he had seen God's own salvation in Jesus. Now, he hadn't yet seen everything Jesus would do. He just knew that this was the one who would come to save the world. And that's what Christmas is about. That's what Easter is about. That's what life is about. It is his story. And because of him, uh, we can live in peace and we can die in peace. So, uh, pray today that you and I will know that and walk in that in the midst of all the anxieties, in the midst of all the struggles in life, that we can say, you know what, Jesus came for us and Jesus is risen from the dead. Nothing else matters. All right, go in peace and